Hey what's up guys, it's the Ghost Hacker here and I am back for another Visual Studio tutorial and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to either add or subtract a number from a text box or a label, whatever holds a number pretty much you can use this for. Now it's not hard to do at all, it's very easy, but before we start I want to quickly say that I did upgrade to Visual Studio 2015, you guys don't have to, you could be on 2013 or 2010, it don't matter, all of them will work and um, yeah so let's hop in here create ourselves a new project and I'll just put the default name for the form get that loaded all right we're gonna need a button so go up here type in button very easy not hard uh, okay move that there and I'm gonna rename the text of my button to um, click to add I guess and we're gonna need a label or whatever you guys want to uh, do this with we're gonna change the text to zero or whatever number you want to start at and we are gonna double click our button now it's not hard at all we're gonna do label one dot text so grab the text of the label and then make it equal the label one dot text and we want to do plus one so we'll grab it make it equal itself and then add one very easy, not hard at all. So we'll try that out real fast. Click it, and we're going. We're counting. Super easy, not hard at all. Now, if you want to make it count automatically by itself, so once you click the button, it'll just keep counting up and keep going, we're going to need a timer. So we're going to grab a timer, add that to our form. Go down here, it'll show up right down here. And here you can change the time of it. I'm going to leave it default, but um, that's how many milliseconds in between each time it'll count so now we're going to open our actually we're going to need another button real fast so we'll grab that there we go we named the text of that to start timer there we go and now we're going to double click our timer real fast and we're going to do the same thing label one dot text equals label one dot text plus one there we go and now we need to go under our button or our second button and we need to do timer one dot uh, start and our brackets very easy not hard at all and now if we start our program and try this it's counting and now it's going really fast because going every 100 milliseconds that's not even a second so uh, it's going really fast, and we can still use this to count even faster. Count, 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 and we're good. So now if you want to subtract a number, I'm sure you guys have guessed. Just don't put a plus, put a minus. Right there. And we'll try that just so you guys can see. Click it, and we go into the minuses. But uh, if your number is, say, 100, it'll count down from a 100, and then go into the minuses after the, after uh the zero. I'm sure you guys know that. Click that and it works. There we go. That's how you do it. Very easy, not hard at all. Hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. If you did, please leave me a like. If you didn't, leave a dislike and tell me why in the comments. And um, until next time guys, hope you guys have a great day and bye bye.